Hi everybody, my name is Elemina P and welcome to the Summer of 58. I have heard amazing things about this game, so I'm very, very excited to get into it. We are going to Russia to check out an abandoned camp. So let's get started. Sometimes people make up things that aren't there. It seems to them that some entity controls their mind and their life. They do terrible things that can drive you crazy. I don't believe in paranormal phenomena. I believe that the troubles that people commit are their own fault or those who brought them to this. And in order for you to believe your eyes and not fictions, I made revealing videos about paranormal phenomena in two houses in which, according to people's stories, madness was happening. My name is Alex Morton, and we're getting started. <laughs> I am not controlling this. <sighs> okay. This is cute. Something's gonna jump out of me. I'm not even controlling this and I'm nervous. I searched all the corners, but I didn't find any evidence confirming paranormal activity in these houses. Now I'm going to an abandoned pioneer camp in Russia at the request of my subscribers to find out if the rumors that the locals have been talking about for so long are true. They say that there are ghosts of dead people in this place at the hands of one of the residents. He himself was never found. The body of those people were also not found. Local residents avoid this place, and those who were touched by this tragedy do not allow to open the doors of this building in memory of the dead and missing. I came to Russia to investigate what happened, to find out if the rumors are true, and to find evidence of this. In keeping with my tradition, I closed the doors of the building behind me so that there is no temptation to leave it, and I am staying here for a few nights recording a report. I have a video camera, a sleeping bag, a backpack with things, and food with me. This is what happens to people in horror movies that don't make it out. So, I don't think we're going to have a happy ending. <laughs> but then again, do horror games ever have a happy ending? I don't think they do. All right, you're just throwing me in here. Need to explore the camp. All right, well, I don't want to. You signed up for this. Russian to English dictionary. That'll be helpful. I was translating some Russian books in college, and I took a Russian English dictionary with me to help with the translation. Found it at the local market. All right. We have a video camera. Okay, so we can zoom in. What's this? So a sleeping bag, okay. I brought a sleeping bag with me because I plan to stay a few nights. To find hidden objects. What's this? It's food, okay. I don't want to have lunch. I'll eat it later when I'm hungry. You are going to starve to death, aren't you? I don't want to go that way yet. <laughs> oh, we're going to have kids. So as far as I know, this is taking place in 2008. But all of the bad stuff happened in the summer of 1958. Okay. You made that very anticlimactic. What's that? Something I can't have, apparently. Okay. All right, we're in the bathroom. We all know I hate bathrooms. Bathrooms, for the most part, have made me cry. Can I not mess with that? And also, do I have unlimited night vision or no 
lighter. I'll take that. I can't always use it. Oh, great! All right, well, that's fine. I got night vision. The thing is, is do I run out of batteries? Is this outlasty? Or, like, am I good? Is this gonna be outlasty or are we okay? What's that? Nothing I can have. Ooh. Okay. That means I could pick up that. I can't run. I mean, I can pick up this picture? Apparently not. It doesn't like that picture. Okay. Um. I would very much like to leave. Gas mask. Oh, kitties. You gotta feed the kitties. What the hell are you? All right, I'm not seeing anything I can grab. Do you guys hear a purring? I want to go home. <laughs> Stop it! In 1958, towards the end of summer, parents called the camp to find out if everything was all right with their children, but no one answered. When they arrived at the camp, they found no one, only abandoned things in a mess. All the locals helped in the search of the missing children, but all in vain. Great! I'm going to find the kids. I'm going to end up finding the kids. Okay, so. Where? <gasps> Kitty! I did hear purring! Hi! Hello, baby! Can I pet the cat? Can I pet the kitty? Kitty! Wait, do I go get the food that I have to feed the kitty? Excuse me, sir. Or ma'am. I just want to play with the cat! I just want to play with the cat. I need to look for candles! Okay, okay. I want to I want to feed the cat. Kitty, will you come? You were not there before. I just I just want to play with the cat. I just want to play with the cat. Can I not play with the cat? Like is that not a thing for me? Is that not a thing for me? I just want to play with the kitty. I just want to play with a kitty! Okay. I've got a lighter.
Girl, look at three. What do I do to prepare for the evening? Night one! Is this like a Five Nights at Freddy's? No. No. A no. I don't have my camera. Give me the camera. Please don't make me do this. Why is there a crow in here? What y'all doing with the crows? How did the crows even get in? Hi. Yeah, it's creepy. You wanted to do this. You started it. I don't want to be a part of it. What's that? Oh, are those all the kids? I don't like how it turns off the, um, the nightlight. Whenever you pick something up. Hello! Okay. Okay. Do the kitties ever eat? Are the kitties here? Okay. Okay. Why did I, like, I, what do I do? Hmm, I don't want to go down there. Heard a door open, but I don't see a door. Hello? I don't like you. Guys, I hear something eating. And it is not Mr. Whiskers. Okay, kids. Now what? I don't see anything else I can pick up. Okay. Dude, how are you not scared? What was that?
You close my door? No. No, no, no. No, no, no. You are not locking me in here. Excuse me. What? That's fine. It's fine. Why can't I not pick that up and bang the door down? That should be a thing, right? Oh, I don't like this at all. What is that? Okay, it's one of those, I think they're, Ru they're Russian dolls that you stack on each other. Let me out. This is not funny. Please. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, need to find my video camera. Great, kid, you lost your video camera. You could be older than me, I don't know, but you're a kid, I don't know your name. Hey, birdie. Can't read it, I need to get my Russian English dictionary. All right, well, where's that? Why are you losing all your stuff? Okay, the vents might not be a thing. So that's, that's good. That's, that's a plus. Wait, wait. Wait. Ha. Wait. All right. You're not welcome here. Okay. Thanks for that. The one who hit me on the head took the candles. I had to figure out what's going on here. Yeah, she took your candles, dude. She knocked you out. I think that's a good time to say bye. I think that might be a good time to say bye. You know? <laughs> okay, we're okay. We're all right. We're tough. There are legends that there was an orphanage near this camp and there lived a strange girl who was afraid of water. She did not wash and did not go to the river. One day, the older girls decided to laugh at her, tied her hands and poured water over her. She was very scared and ran away. They couldn't find her for many days, but they decided that she was dead. But one night she came back in her pajamas all wet and killed everyone who bullied her and that her spirit appears in the bathroom on a full moon. How about no? Because I'm in the bathroom. And I'd prefer not to be in the bathroom when she pops up. Somebody bullied this youngin. And she got revenge on the people who bullied her. But I did not bully you, my friend. You hear it. That's a catchy tune you got, kid. <sighs> Late at night when people fall asleep. No need for fun. No need for a fool. And the bells are empty and the eyes are full of bitterness. 
and the courtiers do not know what fun means to the fool. The fool decides that enough is enough, and he, that night, wearing a sad suit, poisons the court and the king. I'm sad at heart, but the plan is not a failure. The fool will no longer be fun for you. Guys, we, like, that's, that's the jester. Um, okay, so we are, we are dealing with a child that has been excruciatingly bullied. And now is taking revenge on everybody. But I did not bully you. I did not bully you. I was not here. I would have helped you. Please don't get mad at me. I am new. Please don't hate me. I just got here. Mm. Okay. That was not there before. Can I close the door? No? Okay. I cannot close the door. Body. It's a dead something. Oh, head prints. What's this? Well, that's pretty. These dolls freak me out. But then again, I don't like dolls of any sort. Can I just leave? I feel like that would be the smart thing to do, dude. You got knocked upon the head, and you're still here. And you're still here. Do you realize that that makes no sense, my dude? The director of the Pioneer Camp, Maria Anatolivina? Disappeared like the rest of the camp workers. Maria had previously taken care of the children in an orphanage from 1944 to 1950. She was a caregiver who devoted herself only to work. Discipline was the most important to her, so the parents entrusted their children to her. Well, I guess they got mad at her. But is she... She said she disappeared too. Right? She disappeared? Yep. So they can't be mad at her. She's gone, too. That was nasty. Am I missing something in here? Okay, there's nothing. Hey, school me! Okay. What's up with all the dead birds, dude? Like, I don't know about you. Need to find a fuse. Okay, where's the fuse gonna be? Okay. Did you guys see how it turned me around? Like, uh, no, you're not leaving this room yet. Like, excuse me, I wanna go home. I don't even know what a fuse looks like. I honestly don't know what the fuse looks like. That's a photo. Light bulbs. Is that a fuse? <gasps> okay, so a fuse looks like a normal fuse in all the other games I've played. <laughs> then I'll... Okay, we're gonna take the box. I'm okay with that. Need to take the box to the sleeping bag. Okay. Hello! I'm- I'm at my sleeping bag. <sighs> it's 
I'm gonna take the fuse. I don't like how everything else is blurry in the background. You have fun in there, lady. You have fun. I'm gonna go this way. Yep. Um. Give me that. I need you. Here. Here's your fuse. Now, how do I get this to work? That's a fuse, right? How do I drop it? <laughs> Need to insert the fuse, okay? Oh, shoot. Did I just... Did I just... I did. Where's my fuse? Well, where does the fuse go? Wouldn't be in the bathroom. Is this a fuse box? Wait, really? That's a fuse box? No. No, no way. No, that's a phone. Fuse. Ah! Really? It was that simple? I was at the wrong spot. Okay. All right. Let's go turn on the light bulb, shall we? No. 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 Stab it. Quit. Whew. Whew. Okay. That light bulb works. I think I have to go repair the light bulbs? I don't want to go to bed yet! I ain't sleeping. No! I don't think there's anything for us to really do. But we all know it gets worse as time goes on, and now I got a new room to explore at night because, well, actually, I got two new rooms to explore at night because they're both open. Like, I'm good. This doesn't sound right. I don't want to do this. The devil's hour. All right. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. Don't we know that anytime between three and four is the devil's hour? We don't, we don't, we don't, we don't do this. Okay. Check the bathroom first, because the bathroom's the scariest. I've got a first aid kit. Why can't I keep it? What am I supposed to do? Am I just supposed to roam the halls? No. Oh, shoot. Stop. Oh, God, no. Okay. Quit! Please stop! Please quit! If I... Oh, my God! I'm going to flip after you! Excuse me, ma'am! That don't look normal! Is she... Stab it! Can I die in this game? Where'd the meat go? Oh, God! Can I hide in the corner? 
No, that box wasn't there, and we're gonna go mess with it. It's locked. Be interesting to know what's inside. No, it would not, sir. This is when we leave. This is when we leave. This is when... Don't f up my light bulbs! I don't... You! You stay in there! Gosh, dang it. Okay. Gimme, 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 gimme. Okay. You! Lady! No one's interested. Fix the light bulb, please. Okay. Okay. Oh, I don't want to go in here. Hello? Oh! What are you? Oh, no. What is what box? You see a bathroom box and you gotta go mess with it? Oh, no. Oh, no. Walk down with your head. No! Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't want to play this no more. Ah, it drools. It drools. It freaking drools. I don't want to do this. No. God dang it. Go away. And nobody interested. Why are you over my <laughs> <laughs> Why are you over my sleeping bag? Go away! I'm not interested in this anymore! Oh! Dude! Dude, is your YouTube channel worth this much? You did all of this for your subscribers and you're gonna die! No! No! Go away! What? Is my light bulb messed up again? Who is breathing like that? Who is breathing like that? Oh my god, well, I just got this box of light bulbs and you people keep messing up my lights! Wait, wait, did all of my lights go out? Like, it won't let me pick up a light bulb. Oh my god! Oh my god! No! Ow! That's fine, you can stay locked. Oh, go in here with the freaky ass box. Quit breathing! Okay. Well, now all I hear is flies. Quit! Being a butt cheek and throwing crap everywhere! Learn your manners! Turn the light on! Now you're open. Now you're freaking open! Congratulations! You gonna eat me? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, you are! Can we not? <clears throat> <laughs> oh, golly! Okay. 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 We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Please stop. Please stop. Hey! You gave me a key. All right. Well, I guess you're nice. From 1950, a loud scandal in an orphanage for orphans. The nurse cruelly mocked the residents. One of the employees reported violations of authority. A decision is made to close the institution. We remind you that the shelter was opened since 1944. Children who were left without parents during the war lived there. Why are we close? Why, why, why you gotta be a butt cheek and like mock the kids? Like you an adult. Be an adult. Let's go open this box. Quit opening my doors. What's gonna be in the box? A dead thing? Dear diary, oh no. Today is the annual opening of my camp. I have been preparing for this for three years so that this summer will be special for me. During these days, I will bring up real people in them, but they will also help me a lot. Okay, how 
help you with what? Now, I ain't a 58. I don't want to go back to 58. I'm good. Hello? There is no light in the building. Oh, my God. All right. Okay. Oh, my. All righty. Okay. This is the night that the accidents happened, and I am back here. Can we not? Can we not? I'd love to have been raised in the 50s, 60s, and, you know, been a teenager in the 70s, but I didn't mean like this. I did not mean like this. This is not what I wanted in my life. Hey, why is there a random scale in the corner? That just doesn't seem very nice. Children and caregivers are asleep. I will not bother them. Okay. It sure as hell doesn't sound like everybody's asleep. It's a music box. Something broke. Hi. I used to be a teacher and I don't like this. Anna, we need to run. It's all because of the director. I was spying on her. She was talking to someone about something bad. You have to believe me. Warn everyone. We don't have much time until I hid her key in the closet. We can make it. Help me. What an asshole. Okay. What... Hi. It's a key. All right, key to the safe. Well, I don't know where the safe is. You filthy child. Okay, well, you're very angry. Ah, there's a safe. Stole the second gas cylinder. I need to spray sleeping gas so all the children can be transferred to the hospital for surgery and then return back. The filter is missing and the glass is broken. We worked together with Alexei Sergeevich in an orphanage. Then I acted carelessly and received a complaint. The director had to close the shelter. I was suspended for medical work. Now I will not make such a mistake because only he knows about our agreement. I must continue to find people for him to collect their kidneys. Kidneys. And Alexei will help to perform a heart transplant operation for Ivan. According to all indicators from the medical record, Yakov is an ideal donor. I'll set an accident and no one will look for him. What? So they, that, so they're, they're collecting kids and taking their organs. That's what this game is about. A special boy, Yakov, came to the camp. He has no parents or relatives, and he became my favorite because he is so similar to my son Ivan. I really want to see him. Yakov is a good boy, although he does not speak, but he understands everything and does everything I ask. In the afternoon, I had to meet with Alexei at the shelter where we used to work. He ordered us to fulfill our agreement tonight. The day has come. Yakov will help me with this. Before going to bed, children always invent horror stories while the counselors put them to bed. This can distract them. Oh, you are a cruel lady. You are a cruel, cruel lady. Oh! Woo! Hi! 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 Hello! 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 Hi! 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 What am I supposed to do with you? Get out of my way! 
Well, this is an interesting game. The night of 58, they were taking kids to collect their organs is what I'm understanding so far. And this dude has been knocked out and losing track of time and sees nothing wrong with this. Like, I would skadoodle and get out, like, as quick as possible. But if this is the kind of content you enjoy, please press that like button, subscribe, and ring that bell so you get notified in the future when part two comes out. We have finished nights one and two, so I'm excited to see what's going to happen next time. Until then, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.